What is up you guys? It is Brick Lover Brad here in the Lego room and today I am doing some Lego sorting. I'm starting off by sorting one of the Pick a Brick boxes, the very first Pick a Brick box that I got back in December of 2023, adding those things to my Lego collection and then I might just do something a little crazy. And that little crazy thing is unboxing the final Lego Pick a Brick cup ever. This would be my final time ever unboxing a cup because they don't even sell them anymore. So this would be really cool. But first, let's get to the rest of the sorting. So I'm working on putting away some of the pick a brick parts that I got at the Lego store back in 2023 when I first got the Lego box for the first time. I'm so happy that I was able to pick up a bunch of these tan tiles. Although I'm running out of space, I don't know where they're all going to go. I'm ticked that I actually only picked up two of these door frame pieces. These are the door frames for these weird door pieces here. I got these door pieces sometime in the summer, but they had no frames at the store and then they had frames and for whatever reason I only got two which I have a way more doors than that so that's really annoying and finally the last piece that I'm really excited about is this Lego candle piece right here so I saw these on the pick a brick wall for the first time like in person I've seen them on my log discord but the first time in person I saw these so I got just a whole bunch of each of the pieces no idea what I'm gonna do with them like they'll probably go nice somewhere in the Lego city but they're still really a fun piece but now the question is should I assemble them or should I store them together or store them separately I have no idea so I added this little divider here as well so I could separate these leaf pieces so i added the golden pieces these were the first time i've ever had these apparently in my collection this had just the, all two of them and it was like half full so grabbed the divider pushed this all forward and managed to add the gold here and then i moved the purple that i just had sitting in here over here so now it looks a lot better i added a bunch of the one by one of the blue pieces here but i just don't really need more of them in my lego collection so i'm going to list these ones just in my brickling store there's not a lot there but might as well get you know might as well sell them if i don't need them i'm gonna list these flags too while i'm at it just because as you guys can see my flag drawer is a little full and i just didn't have room for any more and not that i need more because i don't use flags all that often i also just got a bin here for the lego candle pieces i think it's a little too overflowed first let me grab my label maker from the laundry room because i want to make sure i label that drawer before i put it in the container it looks like literally the only thing i use it for is lego and is it candel or candle no the other way was definitely right something you guys should know about me I am a terrible speller. And oh, I made, I meant to make it right candles, but candle will do just fine. Oh, and look at that. I might just get it to fit. Uh, uh, no, no, pieces are flying, pieces are flying, abort. Well, I did get it to fit. No, now it's not going to come out. Okay, I'm going to have to remove some of them. Probably throw them in the Brickling store as well if they don't fit. So a little bit of a backstory about this pick a brick cup. I think I picked it up probably back in 2017 when I worked at the Lego store. It is now 2024 in case you haven't been able to keep track. But I haven't opened up this pick a brick cup ever since. And it's just because I haven't really, I guess, needed any of the pieces that are inside. I've used it as a prop in many of my videos over the last few years. Anytime I needed to show a full pick a brick cup. But yeah, I figured it's probably time now to open it up. This will be my last time ever opening up a Lego pick a brick cup because they don't sell pick a brick cups anymore. They only sell the pick a brick boxes. So this is a really cool experience that of course I wanted to document. Inside the pick a brick cup, we've got a bunch of these uh, dark tan two by two tiles. We've got some of these blue flower pieces and the green like seaweed leaf pieces. Looks like there's some one by two dark tan bricks in there as well, which I didn't even know they were in there. This is the first time I've really noticing that. And of course the inspiration to finally open up this picker brick cup comes not just because I've had it since 2019 and it needs to open, but because as you can see, I try to put all the two by two tan tiles that I got from this last time at the picker brick wall onto into the drawer. And when I try and shut it, it does not shut and it's going to make a big mess like the candles did. So I think it's time to have a pick a brick cup of just these two by two dark tan tiles. When I restarted my Lego collection later last year, I vowed to no longer have any pick a brick cups filled of Lego parts because I wanted them all in the collection here. But at the end of the day, that just wasn't possible. So I did have to have a few pick a brick cups still down here of a bunch of different Lego parts that are in my collection. Uh, I tried to keep it as minimal as possible, but it just didn't make sense to have all of these in the Pappy Max drawers if they were sometimes taking up way too much space. So I guess I'll just add another cup here of the two by two dark tan tiles. I remember as a kid, I could never have enough of the tiles. So it just makes me a little bit happy that I'm an A-fall now with so many tiles I'm complaining about it so that's really how things go but now you guys here it is the moment of truth let's open this thing up so I'm not gonna lie I'm actually a little bit sad that today is my last time ever opening up a Lego pick a brick cup I think I probably got my first pick a brick cup Back in like 2012 or so, I went to Virginia Beach then and I definitely got pick a brick cups then. I don't remember if I'd ever really been to a Lego store before that um, where I would have been able to get pick a brick cups. I know I had been to one at like downtown Disney, but I know I didn't fill any pick a brick cups there. And then we didn't really have them in Canada. Uh, Disney's 2008, 
Virginia Beach was 2012, and I don't think I went to Toronto in between then. So I think we're opening that Pick Up Our Cup probably for the first time in 2012. That means it's almost been, it's been like over 12 years since I got my first Lego Pick Up Our Cup. So this is a pretty, you know, special occasion. A pretty sad one for sure to make this being my last Pick Up Our Cup ever. It's pretty crazy to think. It's pretty pretty crazy to think that. And I guess it's not the final time I'll ever open Pick a Brick. Like obviously they've got the new Pick a Brick boxes now, but the Pick a Brick boxes, even though they're better in my opinion, they're not the same as the cup. But anyway, here goes. Let's open up the cup. I'm doing it, you guys. I'm breaking the seal one last time, taking the tape off one at a time. I'm doing this a lot slower than I normally would. I wanna like seize the moment, if that makes sense. But here we go, look at that. That is a fun surprise. I did not know there were some spiders on top of this. Oh crap, I really, uh, this is definitely a mystery cup. But all right, let's dump it out here now. And there we have it. The last Lego pick a brick cup that I will ever open up here on my channel probably has just been opened. I'm gonna really look stupid if in a few months now, Lego runs out of pick a brick boxes or something like that and reverts back to the cup because I made this whole video talking about how it's my last time ever opening up a pick a brick cup. So I'm not saying I hope it's the last time ever because this was sad, but I'd look so stupid if it wasn't the last time ever. But all right, enough about the nostalgia. Let's take a look at some of the parts that I got inside. So as I mentioned, I did not know that spiders came in this set. So I, this box, I'm really excited about that. That was a very nice surprise there. I didn't notice them at the top. Of course, the main part of this cup, like I mentioned, is the 2x2 two two dark tan tile, which is really fun. Nice and shiny. These definitely feel like they've been in a cup for the last four years. So pretty crazy. I've got obviously some flower pieces here as well. Some of these dark tan one by two bricks these like cp seaweed slash like weed pieces whatever you guys want to call them and i think that's all the lego bricks that are in here this time you guys will have to let me know down in the comments below what you think the longest may be that you've ever had a pick a brick cup that you've never opened up i know mine was like four and a half five years the one i opened up in today's video but i imagine some eight falls probably have one that is a lot longer Oops, so I didn't realize that pretty much the whole pick a brick cup was just these 2x2 two two dark tan tiles. So I filled it up as much as I can. These are the rest of the parts that also came out of that pick a brick cup, plus the spiders there. So just these ones. So not too many, but I might not actually get as many of the 2x2 two two tan tiles from the drawer over here in the cup as I was hoping. There, I kind of got the cup sealed and I got the drawer closed. So now I'll just put it down here on the shelf with all the other pick a brick cups of parts that I just have too many of in my Lego collection. And now I'm just gonna spend the next little bit putting the rest of these parts away from the pick a brick cups from uh, both 2019 and 2023. All right, sweet. So for the rest of these parts, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and throw them in the Bricklink store just because they didn't fit in the Pappy Max and I don't need some of the quantities of them. So I'll just put them in here on this shelf for now and I'll get to them probably in a few months. All right, you guys, so thank you so much for tuning in today to watch me open up the final pick a brick cup that I'll probably ever open. And of course, sort some of the other Lego pieces that I have here in my Lego collection into my Lego storage solutions, the Pappy Max. Look at me, I'm getting a little bit better of sorting Lego as I go. And no, I didn't film the clip of me just dumping some pieces in the unsorted bin. I swear I didn't do that. I swear I, I, I didn't do it. But anyway, you guys, thank you so much for tuning in to today's video. Thank you again for watching. If you did enjoy, of course, please don't forget to leave a like, comment, and of course, subscribe. And I'm looking forward to seeing you all here in the next one.